Hello my Wolfpack and welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon Competitive Guide video. So today we're covering Mien Shao. I think it's called Mien Shao. I, I don't actually know. I've never really learned its name. It hasn't been the most prominent mom, but it's actually a pretty cool mom with good attack and good speed. So first of all, we have a um, Life Orb Regenerator set. Regenerator, re regenerator heals a third of your health every time that you switch out, which is kind of huge because, you know, even if you lose like a load of health, you can just switch out and come back in, and you're already looking pretty good. And that really helps with the life orb there as well, because the life orb's going to be dwindling you down. You switch out, you come back in, and it just generally nullifies anything that happened. Then we've got high jump kick, knock off sword stance, and poison jab on this thing. So sword stance is to increase your attack up. Um, not that you necessarily need it, but sometimes it can be a pretty good thing that comes in clutch. High jump kick because it's super strong. Um, it can be dangerous though because you can lose 50% of your HP, uh, max HP if you do miss. Uh, but the trade off is you have a really, really strong fighting type attack. Knock off to get rid of items because they can be super frustrating. And poison jab because hitting fairies is a huge thing. Fairies being a really prominent thing. Um, and you can't really hit flying types of this set, but knock off and poison jab should hopefully cover you somewhat for it. And then for EVs, we have max attack and max speed with a jolly nature, so more speed and less special attack, and four EVs and special defense. So this thing is a hit hard, hit fast thing. If you want to set up a Swords Dance, you can, and then just go to town with your other three moves. And the second set we have is a defensive set. Um, so I did debate whether to run this as defensive or specially defensive, but then I saw bulk up and I was like, this could probably work a bit better defensively. You can put it as max defense, special defense though, and just have it more as a tanky mod, but its um, base stats aren't the best, so I think just sticking it with a um, defensive nature is better. So we have leftovers and regenerator again. Um, drain punch to get some health back in general. Bulk up to increase your attack and defense. Toxic just to wear them down generally through the time and taunt to stop things from setting up because things setting up can just cause so much so much issue, so much damage. So taunting them can be good. Also prevents things like um I can't think off the top of my head what it was called. Uh, like hazards setting up spikes, stealth rocks, toxic spikes, and all of that. And yes, that is it for me and Shell. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you have, please do like, subscribe, and comment. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Anyways, I'm out of here, so I've had a good bye, and I'll see you soon. <laughs>